So after having two miscarriages, I'm finally pregnant again. This time when I found out I was pregnant, I stopped smoking immediately and started going to the hospital every 48 to 72 hours to make sure my HCG levels were increasing. We late, an hour and 20 minutes late because of this fool. Why do this man want to play? He in my face, I'm about to punch off his face because he want to play. I'm in pain. He want to stay here playing and like the he the paparazzi. Is a part of when we get home, I saw, I'm fishing game. This morning, the nurse says to come off. back with my information. Me and baby daddy is laid up in the hospital bed. We're still here. Still waiting for them to come back. They said by the hour. Oh, baby, all right. I love my baby daddy, y'all. So special, special like short bus special. Y'all see the sweat beads on my, <laughs> look at the sweat beads on my face. <laughs> and he video. Out of a matchbox. I don't know if they got blankets that small. Maybe you think they got blankets that small for a little, um. Hey, the camera out of the blood clot, yes, no. Now we're good. After dozens of doctor visits, getting poked with numerous needles, my HCG levels were in the clear. Jesus Christ, this pregnancy is not pretty on me at all. I look like something off American Horror Story Season 4. <laughs> People keep asking me what's the worst part of my pregnancy so far. I would have to say the acne, because I've never had acne like this in my life, ever, never. But when I think about how it's all because I have another me growing inside of me, it kind of makes it a little bit more bearable. And now I'm 17 weeks pregnant, happier than ever, and just praying to God that my pregnancy leads to a happy, healthy baby. Bitches, on the way to a doctor's appointment, baby bomb, baby daddy. Should be on fleek like that though. Cute, 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 fly, swaggy, fleek. What up, bitches? I'm so fucking excited. Oh my God. Guess what I'm finna do? So y'all remember, I went to my last appointment on January 5th, and I told y'all that my doctor didn't want to do a gender reveal until the 26th. So because I'm so anxious to find out what I'm having, and I don't want to wait until the 26th, I made an appointment at a private ultrasound office for today. So I just left my house and I'm driving all the way down to Hollywood to this office for my appointment. And as long as the baby doesn't hide, I'm gonna find out today what I'm having. I'm so fucking excited. Like the whole time I really didn't care what I was having since I had two miscarriages. I just wanted a healthy baby, but now I kind of want a girl. 
So I'm just hoping that baby fly cooperates and allows these people to see what the sex is so mommy could just get over it. <laughs> I need to know. And then I gotta practice my surprise face for the 26th when I go see my doctor because I don't want him to know that I snuck and cheated. <laughs> My doctor don't want me eating sugar and sweets, but I got low blood pressure and my mama said it ain't good to just cold turkey sweets like that, so I'm gonna do what my mama say. And on God, when you ass eating Skittles, like this one, this flavor right here, this the best flavor to eat. I'm telling you, bitch, this shit right here, this shit right here, bitch. Bitches been hating all fucking year. Shit, y'all don't get tired. The fuck, the fuck. everybody can't be kept days night. Well, I just made it here. I must be super excited because I never get nowhere on time and I'm 30 minutes early, bitch. Watch it. <laughs> I think I just expected it. And I'm super excited, but being early gave me time to eat my motherfucking salad. I stopped and picked up on the way. I just got inside. I'm waiting. The receptionist let me sit on her desk. Oh my god, y'all! We just came out of the place. I'm so fucking excited. I know my baby gender. <laughs> I think I'm going to make y'all sweat for a little bit, dog, before I tell y'all. <laughs> yes. Right now, I'm going to follow this crazy person to the mall down here in Sheridan. i never been there, but I'm going to see what I can squeeze. I know baby fly gender. I know baby fly gender. You want to know? I know you want to know. You want to know? You want to know too, don't you? I know. <laughs> Bitches to go and follow my baby's godmother, Sheena, at Sheena050707. Oh my god. And Sheena, I know they're gonna test you. I don't care how many private snaps they send you asking about baby fly gender. It's a secret right now, bitch. It's a secret. It's a secret till I tell them. Shh. Y'all is blowing up my snaps with all type of crazy mess right now, thinking it's gonna make me tell y'all baby fly gender. <laughs> Not till I'm ready. <laughs> So before I let y'all know what baby fly gender is, I just want to tell y'all a little bit about my experience at the private ultrasound place. It was amazing. The last time I seen baby fly on the ultrasound monitor, baby fly was like seven weeks old. It was like the size of a tadpole, nothing to see. So today was just crazy. Today it was just crazy. It was like seeing my baby for the first time. I seen the head, the legs, the arms, the body moving around, the heart beating crazy. The facility I went to was called the bonding site. It was really nice, really pretty, really relaxing, really laid back. They were really nice. I got the basic gender reveal package. It was um, a 15 minute session with the nurse watching the baby on the monitor. It was so nice. With the package came two printed out pictures of Baby Fly, two digital pictures on the CD, and a video DVD of the whole ultrasound session from the monitor. A lot of y'all trying to guess the baby gender based on my level of excitement, but my excitement level isn't about the gender, it's about making it this far in my pregnancy after two miscarriages. I just keep pinching myself wondering, is it real, is it real, like did I really make it this far in my pregnancy, like God is so fucking amazing, like I'll be so paranoid every day. But yeah, I ain't gonna tell y'all the baby gender right this second. I'ma tell y'all, but just not right now. So stay tuned. <laughs>